coming at your ass like a fast ball. You ain't got no cash, well that's y'all fault. Hit them with that jug, make them somersault. Stack that paper up, I can take a summer off. Money in the flow, money in the flow. What up, YouTube? Y'all know the fuck it is, man. If you don't, it's your boy Von. And before we even jump into this video, I just want to say I don't got no beef against Shorty. I ain't got none. You know what I'm saying? We ain't got no kind of conflict. The point of this video is me speaking to him from a real nigga perspective. You know what I'm saying? And on top of that, um, this ain't no hating that shit neither, man. I, I respect what he do, but I just got a problem with what he do. You know what I'm saying? I respect the grind. You know what I'm saying? Salute to you for that. You doing your thing out there. But what I don't like is how you play with our lifestyle like it's some kind of game or something. Now for y'all who don't know, people who don't know, I've been born and raised in Chicago all my life and I still reside here right now, you know what I'm saying? And I don't like the fact of how you just think this a game or something, like this some kind of joke or something. It's not a joke. This shit that we live about this lifestyle, this shit ain't no joke, man. This shit is real. And when you not from Chicago and you speak on that, a lot of people from Chicago get offended about it, especially when you not speaking facts, when you out here saying what you want to say, just talking outside of your neck, uh, voicing your own opinions and on top of that you just be talking reckless like you know what I'm saying like you can't be tough and you that nigga or something you know what I'm saying or what I mean by that for example um first of all you glorify niggas you be saying how niggas is the the the, the demon in the shot rack they the grim reaper you say something you're gonna get shot and this and this and that you know what I'm saying look I'm gonna tell you what that's doing to yourself first of all the niggas that they in tour with they not gonna like you for the fact that you glorifying them as if they as if they this god or somebody. They're not gonna like you for that. You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying I, I'm in tour with them niggas or I got something against them niggas. I'm just letting him know how shit is. You know what I'm saying? The niggas who in tour with them on feel some type of way because of the way you glorifying these niggas. You know what I'm saying? Is if they all listen? You know what I'm saying? And on top of that, it's like he be saying shit like, "Oh well, people just." Dumb and this and this and that. No parents just be outside shooting people for no reason. Change falling out their pocket like nigga. That's not a joke. You don't even understand why people do what they do. I can understand if you did your research and you actually looked into this shit and you did videos about it. That's understandable. For example, like like one person who do this shit while I salute is college kid. Like college kid, I salute him, man. Whoever he is, he go find out the information. He found out the facts and. You know what I'm saying? He 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 make the stories, make his videos about that. You on the other hand, you voice your own opinion. That's understandable. You got you got the right to voice your own opinion. But when you start talking down on motherfuckers and start saying this and this and that, it's a problem. Like one of your videos, man, you did a video about my cousin, you know what I'm saying? Who deceased now. And you was talking reckless about how this and this and that, how people in shot right. You know what I'm saying? A lot of shit you said. And you offended me, plus you offended my my peoples, you know what I'm saying? The simple fact of you don't know what happened. And you could have did your research and found out and made a video, but instead, you get on one of these videos talking crazy, you know what I'm saying, voicing your opinion on top of that, like you, you talking down on motherfuckers about how this wouldn't have happened if this and this and that, you know what I'm saying, you don't know what the fuck the situation was, you know what I'm saying, and you gotta understand, all these videos you making about all these people in Chicago, all these people got shot and killed, all these people with this and this and that, it ain't just me, you know what I'm saying, feeling the type of way, it's other motherfuckers. Everybody in Chicago don't like what you do, you know what I'm saying? You keep on thinking you're not going to get touched or something. Like, I didn't even know you was a DJ. I thought DJ was just in your name just to be DJ, but actually you a DJ. So you don't ever think that one of these days while you DJing, so a motherfucker going to pop up on your ass and build that with you, you know what I'm saying? But I guess not. I guess you feel like, you know what I'm saying, that Chicago niggas don't travel or something, you know what I'm saying? But that's not true, though. You, you, you know how it is now, man. Motherfuckers traveling now, so... One of these rappers or something might get up with your ass, and if they see you, man, they gonna get on them with you. I know for a fact they gonna get on them. Don't nobody fuck with you from Chicago, you know what I'm saying? And they, and they gotta tell you a lot about yourself right there. When niggas who from the city you talking about don't fuck with you. Everybody fuck with college kid, you know what I'm saying? Everybody from Chicago fuck with college kid, you know what I'm saying? The rappers from motherfuckers in general because, like I say, whoever college kid is, man, he go get the research, and he, he, he talk about just the research, you know what I'm saying? Matter of fact, he don't even do commentary. He just type whatever he got to say but the, the simple fact is everything is facts he go he go do his math go do his research before he starts speaking you on the other hand just be speaking just talking crazy you know what i'm saying and i'm just telling you bro on on, on some on some real shit man you got to stop that because on the simple fact that but you don't get yourself killed or something you know what i'm saying get your ass beat or something 
You know what I'm saying? This ain't no threat for me. I'm just saying in life, bro. This is how this shit is. I'm from here. I know, you know what I'm saying? I know what it's like. And stop playing with our lifestyle, bro. Calling us coons and this and that because you got the whole world believing this. You got the whole world, like, whatever you say, people gonna believe because of your fan base, because of how many people support you and what you do, you know what I'm saying? How many subscribers you got. You can say something like your voice, you know what I'm saying? Your voice whole way. So you out there just saying at whatever you want to say but you got people looking at us different you know what i'm saying a lot of niggas don't like that it's like that shot rock movie that came out niggas who from chicago don't like that shit because they didn't talk about the struggle it didn't talk about what the fuck that we go through it didn't talk about the reason why people had shooting people it didn't talk about you know what i'm saying how how it, it ain't talk about none of that shit you know what i'm saying it ain't talk about how the shit is set up for failure for us how they want us to kill each other and this and this and that they tell you about how the young niggas out here you know what i'm saying running shit basically no ogs out here they just doing what they want to do records they don't tell you about shit like that and that's what everybody don't know. Everybody just from the outside looking in, you know what I'm saying? You and I heard of that you say you would never come to Chirac. I guess that's why you feel like you could say what you want to say. But the thing is, somebody gonna see you, bro, one day. Somebody gonna see you. You know what I'm saying? And God forbid that happen, you know what I'm saying? And, and, and get on with your ass. But I'm just saying, bro, man. You can still talk about our city. You can still do whatever you do, you know what I'm saying? Now, but all I'm saying is, bro. Stop stop talking crazy, man. You know what I'm saying? Stop talking like you can't be touched. Like, stop talking down on motherfuckers, too. And if you're going to talk about shit that's from Chicago, bro, do your research first, man. Do your research. Do your, do your math. You know what I'm saying? Do what you got to do first. Don't just get on the microphone talking behind this computer and on this microphone talking crazy. You know what I'm saying? And then, um, this gameplay I got, bro, I just happened to pull up on him because my man was like, man, he online. Ooh, he's streaming. So I pulled up. So this ain't got nothing to do about him. This is just between me and you. You know what I'm saying? I ain't even got no beef against you. I'm letting you know right now. I ain't got shit against you. I'm just letting you know that little video you made about my cousin, bro. I appreciate that shit, man. Because you should ditch your mouth first. Don't just be on this motherfucker talking crazy. You know what I'm saying? Because you could have found out what happened, but instead you just voiced your own opinion and said what you want to say. You can't be touched or something. And I'm quite sure, bro, you've never been in Chicago a day in your life. So all this information you get, you either look at something or you on the outside looking in, you ain't doing your math or something. So, like I say, man. I salute you for your grind, you know what I'm saying, the whole YouTube grind, you doing your thing, you know what I'm saying, you got probably like 100k subs, whatever the fuck you got, salute to you for that, cause I ain't no hating ass nigga, you know what I'm saying, but what I'm, what I'm trying to tell you is, bro, this like a, that's like a, a life situation, bro, this ain't even about YouTube, like a life situation, man, niggas in Chicago don't like you, bro, and I'm telling you why they don't like you, they don't like you because you do not state facts, you just say whatever the fuck you wanna say, niggas don't like that shit, you know what I'm saying, so, that's all I'ma say, man. Oh, yeah, and I bust your ass in 2K, so, you know what I'm saying? That's basically how it's been about, man. So, man, just a message. This ain't no beef. This ain't none of that. Just a message to you, man. You know what I'm saying? It's your boy Vaughn. I'm out. Go!